we're doing here today is we're going to take a look at Redline's entry into the world of carbon fiber racing, the all new Project 79. Renee Jankowski from Raleigh, North Carolina. I have three boys that are racing. Do you know about the Project 79? No, I don't. Well, the biggest thing about this bike to me, the frame is a stinking work of art. The oversized head tube, the oversized bottom bracket. I mean, something that's never been done before, a through axle on the back, just to stiffen it up that little bit more through the drive. Built-in chain tensioners. Built-in chain tensioners. I know. mean, there's attention to detail is the biggest thing. And everyone that picks this thing up, they just, they can't, the finish is dope. Everything is just spot on. We're lucky to be joined by uh, one of our top racers on the circuit right now. This, we've got a multi-time world champion, former UCI Supercross champion, and current reigning ABA national number one pro, Sam Willoughby. Sam, how'd it go out there today? You look good. We spent years of testing and developing to bring this carbon fiber bike to the masses, and I know you did a lot of testing in it. The thing is built to put the power to the ground. Can you tell us a little bit about some of the features on the bike? Man, it's a, uh, it's a little ahead of its time, the Project 79. We've got a full carbon frame, so it's oversized bottom bracket, oversized head tube. Um, it's as, as stiff as can be, you know. There's uh, no flex. All the power's gone through the pedals, and that's what you want when you're racing at the top level. Oh, there we go right now, our other top dog, Denzel Stein, the people's champion. This guy's a former world champion himself. He's one of the top double A's on the circuit today. Denzel, how you doing today? I'm doing good, and how about you? Oh, everything's going good. I know you and Sam just got on this frame, and you spent a little time training. Yeah, you got to test it out a lot, but you, I know you, that you've just got on, on the track the last few weekends. What are your first impressions of the bike? Oh, man, uh, first impression was it was stiffer, that's for sure. Um, you know, I got it out there in Vegas, and uh, I could tell a noticeable difference. It was lighter, and, uh, you know, just the overall design of the bike was, it was perfect, man. Uh, the icing on the cake is the Sun Ringle Envy hoops. Front and back, uh, you can't forget the answer dagger carbon forks. The Tioga power band up front, Tioga power block up back. Tioga saddle, boom. That's the thing, who else sells a bike right off the rack that's ready to win Olympic gold? I don't think there's anyone out there doing it. But red line. 